Hey guys, it's Sherry Ann Richardson from ExoticGardening.com and I wanted to share with you some plants that I received in the mail today for free in exchange for my honest review. All opinions are of course my own. These came from PlantingTree.com and what we have here is a Meyer lemon and an Alberta peach. They were delivered via FedEx this afternoon, just a few moments ago. And I went ahead and pulled them out of their box and brought them out here and positioned them in kind of a shady area so that the roots and things don't get too hot. Because they are, let me scroll down here. You can see what the plastic that is around both the pot that the peach or that the Meyer lemon is in and the drop it grow bag that the peach tree is in. So they put the plastic around these to help keep the moisture in while they were in shipping so that they didn't dry up and go into shock because they're already going to have a little bit of shock from being shipped and coming into a new location. But the plants look really, really great. And there is definitely plenty of moisture in the bags. So the roots are definitely not dry. But like I said, I just wanted to show you the way these came shipped before I went ahead and cut the bags off and started acclimating these to our area. Now, when your new plants arrive, they're gonna come with some information here. It says, unpack your new plants and trees from their boxes right away. If they appear wilted, give them a thorough watering, they'll bounce right back. And as you can see, these are not wilted at all. They look really, really Shipping may cause some leaves to drop or branches to break. This is normal and will not affect the health of your new plants. Now I have to say the packaging, the way these were packaged in the box that they came in, there was no damage at all. They were very well packaged, very secured, and came out looking really good. It also says if you're not planting them right away, which I'm not, um, it says no problem. Keep your plant in its shipped container out of full sun and protected from the wind and water regularly. So I do intend to plant the peach tree in the ground this weekend. I'm going to move the Meyer lemon into a container this weekend. But until then, what I'm going to do once this video is over is go ahead and cut the zip ties. I'm going to leave the plastic in place on the drop and grow bag, but I'm going to remove it from around the pot of the Meyer lemon. And then I'm going to see if these guys need a drink. I'm going to let them get a little bit of air and I may even move them back into the house because we don't have a fully shaded area. We have a mostly shaded, and I definitely don't want that drop and grow bag to start drying out over the weekend until we can get these in the ground. So now about the drop and grow bag that the peach is in. It says if your plant was shipped in our proprietary drop and grow planting system, just dig your hole, place the drop and grow burlap bag in the center and follow the instructions above. And as you can see, they gave very nice step-by-step -step instructions with both words and photos so that it's very, very easy to follow. They also sent some tips for house and patio plants, which is what the Meyer lemon will be in our climate here in Indiana. And it says, choose a location with the right amount of light away from air vents. Most house plants prefer bright, indirect light. 
Water according to your plant's requirements. Generally when the soil is dry to the touch, two inches down. And when it's time to repot, choose a pot that's one to two inches bigger than your plant's container with holes for drainage. There is also both an email address and a phone number that you can call if you have any questions or any problems when your plants arrive. Now it says our guarantee, your plants will arrive healthy and ready to plant in your landscape. If you experience any issues within the first 30 days, let us know. We'll review your concerns and send a replacement if needed. See website for details. It also says that there is an extended one year warranty. Great extra protection for your plants. Our extended one year warranty covers your plants for a full year after purchase, including from weather and human error. Want to add a one year warranty to an existing order? Let us know. See website for details. So the extended one year warranty is something that you have to purchase separately but it's something that a lot of companies don't offer plantingtree.com clearly does and because these plants these small trees are quite an investment that may be something that you want to look into especially if you are fairly new to gardening and you just want to give yourself that little extra peace of mind to make sure that your plants are going to be okay They carry a full range of trees, including privacy trees, flowering trees, shade trees, fruit trees, shrubs and hedges, and indoor and patio plants. So something else that I wanted to show you, the uh, Meyer lemon tree actually has some new growth already coming on it. If you look, let me see if I can carefully bend these back. If you look right up here at the tips, you can actually see the new little leaves coming on. You see that? And again, this came in a plastic pot. Very well wrapped. It came with a stake to help hold the uh, Meyer lemon steady. The peach tree is a fairly young one that's a little bit wobbly, as you can see, and that's okay because when I plant this, I will be staking it so that it can be sturdy enough not to snap off in the wind, but also have a little bit of play. So when wind comes along, it won't be so stable that it can't move around a little bit because that's really important to allow a tree a little bit of movement but my goal is to make sure that as it grows that it does remain as straight and as upright as possible once it's in the ground so again these two trees came from plantingtree.com i will be putting a link an affiliate link down in the uh, description so that you can go there yourself and see what they might have that you would want to plant. This is a great time to add some fruiting trees either to your landscape or to your patio. There are a lot of fruiting trees that can grow in containers and can be brought inside for the winter. I will also leave a link that tells about some of those plants in the description below. So be sure to check that out. If you guys have any questions, please leave those below and I will let you know. And we will also do some updates on these trees as they grow and mature and adapt to living here with us. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. Thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below. And we will see you in another video.